Hi, this is Bob with Gibbs RV, and today we're looking at a 1986 Bounder Motorhome. This is model 33W. It's low miles. It's pretty good condition all around. You can see it's got a little bit of surface rust here, kind of common here on the coast, but you don't see any damage on this thing. Big awning across the top. And looking at these tires, they're like uh, new. Lots of tread on them. It's got a lot of basement storage compartments you can see here. It's going to open one up and Look at all that room. Still in the process of cleaning up. There's the guy who does it right there. He does a heck of a good job on those storage compartments too. Here's the rear tires you can see. Same type of tread. Uh, around the back side, see it has a single rear window, roof rack and ladder. It's got a trailer hitch and also the mud flaps or actually the brush guards to keep anything uh, kind of debris from flying up for cars behind you. Got awnings over the windows down the side, more storage compartments, and there's also a generator up here. See, it's an Onan Emerald 3 Gen Set. Uh, the miles on this are pretty low. As I stated, the odometer is showing like 32,000, which is kind of common, actually. Motorhomes generally don't have a lot of miles on them because they don't get driven all the time like a car does. Interior wise, everything's kind of a salmon mauve, but this was 1986. And it's all intact, it's all original. Got a big array of cabinetry over the top. The front looks like the television's missing. They took the TV out of the center, but uh, it's not damaged up here. We don't have any uh, fading in the windshield or rock chips. You can see here's our odometer, 32,195. Chevrolet power plant, seats are clean, carpet's really clean. We've got dual captain seats up here. It has a dinette or card table that folds out if you want to swivel the other chair around. So you have two chairs here. The couch folds out for additional sleeping and you can see the condition of this. There's no odors in here like pets or cigarettes, that sort of thing. The dinette booth, that does take down for another bed. The kitchen, it's got, looks like a chrome top cover over a four burner stove. Oven underneath, Magic Chef microwave over the top. Dometic, refrigerator, freezer. Stainless steel, dual basin sink with a real heavy duty uh, cutting board here that fills in the slot. Overhead compartments, pots and pans drawers, silverware drawers. We come to the back, it's got a uh, Frigidaire laundry center, washer dryer combination, and twin beds. Uh, get requests for that, but it's a very rare item. In addition to the twin beds, you've got bunk over the top and fixed cabinetry on this side. So you could sleep three in the center, two, four more. Could get quite the crew inside here. Got a single bathroom in the rear. It's a combination where you've got the toilet, sink, and vanity mirrors. Shower tub stall, that's a big tub too. Fiberglass line and a ton of wardrobe storage or place to put your linens, towels, that sort of thing. Power exhaust vent over the top. Two air conditioning units in this coach. It's a 1986, whether this is your vacation rig, your hunting rig, or even your survival motorhome. Lots of sleeping room. A great project for someone for not a lot of dollars. We're selling this thing as is due to the age, but believe me, if it's in this kind of shape, I don't think it's gonna be around here too long. It's a 1986 Bounder 33W. Gibbs RV in Coos Bay, 1-800-824-4388. Give us a call today and get ready to go see America.